Welcome back everyone to Photography by Harrison. Have you always wondered how your camera would do at its max ISO? Of course, you know this assignment is probably just for the photography nerds out there. But what I'm going to be doing today, I'm going to take my FC 1002, which is a one inch camera, and I'm going to shoot it at 25,000 ISO. The base ISO is 200, but I'm going to shoot at 25,000 ISO. See, is it actually usable? Plus, I'm going to use some AI denoise software to see if that will help, if that ass or whether or not it's usable, it's something you can actually use in a pinch if you have to. And with that being said, I will see you on the other side. Except learning that I like to be outside on a windy 25 degree night, did you learn anything else for us, the performance of the camera? Do you think in a pinch, and it has to be really a pinch, with this high ISO work on my FC 1002? If you think it will work, I think it won't work. Also, what do you, did you think the software really had any effect? Leave your comment below. And of course, while you're down there, hit the subscribe button, and also the notification button so you can get all my videos. And also, when you leave your comments, Tell me what you don't like, tell me what you don't do like, because if you like what I'm doing, you know, I'm going to continue to go out and make more videos. And of course, if you don't like what I'm doing, guess what? They'll also motivate me to go out and do more videos so you like them the next time. You know I say it all the time. When it comes to photography, no one knows it all. And of course, the more you learn about photography, the more you learn you didn't know. And I said this time I was shooting at 25,000 ISO. I'm going to go out again another night shoot at 12,000 ISO, then I'm gonna shoot at 6,000 ISO. See which one of those will actually be more usable. It might, it might be the same as this, might not be usable, but if you don't never use these ISOs, you never know, this might be that one time, maybe that one time only, you might need a high ISO to get the picture. Cause, cause the saying it, it's better to have a bad picture if you really need it, than no picture at all. So with that being said, again, I wanna thank you for coming along with me on my photographic journeys, and I will see you next time.